It's, it's quite extraordinary because when you, you were at the top, uh, you were offered scholarships, you were very well known, widely known, and then you suddenly quit. Yeah, I had, a, I had a big crisis. I had a real crisis. I was, uh, yeah, I was 35 or so. And I was offered a wedding at the time. And then suddenly I, I, I realized that uh, I was working so hard. <laughs> seven days a week and, I don't know, 14 hours a day. And I realized that uh, I was not looking at man and woman anymore, especially those who were in difficulty. I was, it was so intense. The work was so hard that I was losing touch with the people. And um, that was a, a terrible, terrible discovery for me. And at the time, I, I decided to quit science. Yeah, I decided to quit science. I went to see Mother Teresa's and uh, spent one month with uh, their people, the, the brothers, actually. I couldn't be with the sisters. So I was with the brothers, working in the streets and so on. And that, that was a, a decision I made then, that I would try never to turn back my eyes from uh, somebody that I discover who is in suffering. That was a very hard decision, and I certainly did not respect it, but it was a turning point in my life. And then it was but big what discussion. Happened, what happened in Calcutta? Well, I had already in this crisis, but then I spent time there, and I was working in the house for the dead, you know, they, they call it for the dying people. Uh, that was in the temple of, former temple of Kaligat, a um, very extraordinary place. It has been filmed quite often, and, uh, but you had to be there to, to see the impression. All these people, you know, wailing on their, on their small beds and dying, actually. You know? And I was in charge of uh, giving food to a small child who was uh, dying of... Uh, Hunger. I mean, he, he was at the last stage of emaciation. And, so. and uh, suddenly, you know, this person in front of you enters your life. You don't know why, how, why, you know. But you know that suddenly he's a person who enters in you. And uh, at this time, I was so touched that I promised to him, he could not understand what I was saying, but I promised, look, from now on, I will always remember this time and try to change my life to take into account those that nobody takes into account. 